Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Minecraft Story Mode Season 2. Yes, this is the second season. We're here about to push a button, so let's go ahead. Let's push that button. <clears throat> welcome to Jack and Nerm's Adventure Emporium. Oh my gosh, it's him. It's Jack. Sorry, I'm, I I'm a big fan. You push the button. Very, very brave. Thanks for noticing. I am very brave. Always good to see a hero that knows their own worth. <gasps> the warriors of the Whispering Mountain call me the Stab Walker. The Air Titans of the East call me he who slashes like thunder. But you may call me Jack. Lots of names too. The the people of Sky City called me the the Ground Finder. Other people know me as the Wither Slayer. You can call me uh, Jesse. Ah, cool names. So what can I do for you today? Desert Temple, Woodland Mansion. Whoa. Yeah, that's what we're here about. Uh, wow, huh? Crazy glove you got there. Not that I've ever seen one before. Uh, looks real crazy, though. Crazy stuff. Jack, look at yourself. We know you're lying. Why? Yeah, come on, Jack. I... that is, uh... uh... Found it on top of a creepy bottomless pit, right? Spitting out monsters? Yeah, and it had a slot with, like, a... Weird symbol? <sighs> you should have never picked up that gauntlet. It's not for us mortals to tamper with. Wow, I'll be sure to remember that the next time I see a mysterious prismarine gauntlet. That sass won't fix the pit any faster, you know. That pit, it's as deadly as they come. And that symbol you saw was the symbol of the structure block. Legend says it was a mighty tool that could grow civilizations like seeds, create cities in the blink of an eye. You need one of those to close your pit. So where can I get one of these structure blocks? Petra thought maybe an ocean monument because of the prismarine? Oh, it's an ocean monument, all right. The villagers of Mushroom Archipelago call it the Sea Temple. Hmm. No, no, no problem. Guys, this is Nurm, my other half. He's the genius behind all of our fine maps. Nurm, this is Jesse and Petra. Hmm. Hi. Oh, hi. I was just about to tell these two that I can't help them. What? I love your early work. Witherstorm, old builders, awesome. But as a purveyor of fine maps and adventures, your death would be terrible for business. But... Sorry. I just can't. Hmm... Okay, so why don't you come with us then? You could, I don't know, protect us? Be our guide? No... Vowed I'd never go back there again. <sighs> Let me show you something. It's like I said before... Looks like a map of Daisy, a little bit. World's a lot bigger than you think it is, Jesse. Square is where we need to go. Yep. And it's missing because... I, uh... kind of burned it. I threw it into a volcano, okay? What? Why? You didn't need that kind of danger anyway, alright? I swore I wouldn't take anyone else to that temple ever again. 
I refuse to let it take any more lives. Hmm. <laughs> Shut up, Nerm. What? Jack, you don't understand. We need that map. And I hear you. I really do. But I swear to you, it's not worth it. I found a gauntlet just like that once. Teamed up with my friends Voss and Sammy to follow its trail. Neither of them made it out alive. Hence, uh, you know, lava, map, volcano. You remember what I was saying, anyway. But burning the map couldn't erase the horrible memories. And thanks to the curse of my perfect sense of direction, I couldn't forget the location of that temple if I tried. So, if you're the only one who knows where it is... Yep. Without me, you never get into that sea temple. That knowledge is... my curse. Hmm. Jack, Jack, sounds to me like it's your lucky day. Petra and I have a lot of great experience helping people get over their tragic backstories. We do? Yeah. Yeah, we'll tackle that temple together. You know what? You've inspired me. I mean, am I the Velvet Tornado or aren't I? You are, right? Yes. Then yeah, that's the spirit! Nerm, time to get our adventuring things. Mm. Jesse, it's perfect. Structure block? Sea temple? I know, it's amazing. It's almost too good to be true. Ah, yes! And Jack, man, he is awesome, right? Ah, I can't believe it! I'm going on an adventure with Jack. Hey! I like him. Can't wait to see him in action out there. I was just thinking the same thing. He actually seems pretty cool. Nerm, I told you, it's not the admin. Ah, mm -mm. oh, fine. What did he say? Nothing. Villager stuff. Nerm here wants to make a new map of this place. Uh, what with the uh, whole lava volcano incident. <laughs> Easy, Nermy. Don't blow a gasket. That's awesome, Nerm. Welcome aboard. Woohoo! He says, woohoo! Yeah, I figured that out. So that means we're off to the Sea Temple? Don't you think you're looking a little squishy for that? Seriously? I mean, you're wearing a vest. The Vest of Five Fists? Gifted to me by the singing clerics of Port. Okay, geez, I get it. It's a cool vest. Come on, I just need to make a quick pit stop and I can show you some real armor. Oh, Jesse, I'm so glad you're here. Hey, Radar. There is a lot going on. Someone still needs to finalize the ideas for the Founding Day banners. The cake-baking team can't agree on what color to make the front of their shop. The Woolmakers Guild isn't super happy about their booth being next to the firework union. Understandable. The delegate Radar. from Boomtown left word that she wanted to make a speech at the parade. Very odd. Blue hair. Smells like sulfur. Speaking of which, you should probably work on your Founding Day keynote address. Radar. Oh, and rehearse it. Why didn't I factor in rehearsal time? Stupid, stupid. I'm sure I can shift a few Radar. things around. Maybe... Ah, sorry. Got in the zone there. Uh, what's up, boss? I see you brought friends. And a new accessory? Short version, the town's in danger. I stopped it for now, but I think this can help me fix it permanently. I'll be gone for a little bit. Gone? But, Jesse, what about Beacon Town? Founding Day is right around the corner, and if it's really in, in, in danger, who will protect everyone? There's no telling what could happen! Why don't you try leading them, pal? What? Me? That's... this is... Try not to explode. Ah! Jesse, I won't let you down. I know you won't. Good luck, boss. Beacon Town will be waiting for you when you get back. Sure. Ha! Um, goodbye. Oh. <laughs> you said it. Can't believe that's your assistant. He's more wound up than a pack of parrots with a jukebox. 
or a creeper in a herd of cats, or a squid in a, I don't know, a box or something. Anyway, he's real nervous is what I'm saying. He's a little nuts, but his heart's in the right place. <clears throat> if you say so. So, where's this armor of yours? Oh, wow. You got some pretty cool stuff here. Stuff I've never, uh, probably only seen, you know, once or twice. Not as cool as my stuff, obviously, but uh, you're well on your way. Definitely on your way to becoming a big hero like me. Not as big, of course, but, uh, you know, a real, a real great swing. It's just like I always say. I couldn't have done it without my friends. Yeah, friends are the best. <laughs> Love having friends. Hey, wait, is this not where you keep your armor anymore? Yeah, I'm not seeing any armor. No? No, I just had Olivia install a little upgrade while she was here. Oh, we get to pick our armor. Golden Goliath. Or right, hold on. Red, red, redstone riot. Golden Goliath. Ender Defender. Star Shield. Shield of Infinity. Dragon's Bane. Sword Breaker. Tim's armor. Magnus's armor. Adam, Adamantium Impervium. Uh. We'll go with the. Uh, I want to go with one of these for sure. I think we'll go with the Dragon's Bane. Ooh, you look ferocious! <laughs> I couldn't even keep a straight face saying that. That's more like it. Agreed. Hey, uh, can you just give me and Jesse a minute? Huh? Oh. Listen, uh, with the heck mouth and everything, I feel like I didn't get to properly apologize for all the stuff with my sword, Champion City. So, I'm sorry. You won't hear it again, so don't get used to it. I'll totally deny everything later. I appreciate it. I mean, it's pretty big of you. Hey, look, I really meant it. Ah, it really is big of me, isn't it? Okay, now with that sappy stuff out of the way, let's go find us a sea temple. Jack, Nurm, you guys ready to go? Always. So where are we going exactly? It's time to chart a course. Shut up, Nerm. It's an awesome name. blade in hand and drove it right into the head of the Ikara zombie. I slept on an enormous pile of diamonds that night. Enormous? Oh, I can only imagine. <sighs> oh yeah, pretty typical day for me. You'll see. After this, I'll take you to this amazing woodland mansion I found. Yeah. Let's make that happen. It's really far from here. I love it. Hey, that sounds really cool. I can't wait either. Uh, yeah, sure, of course. All right, before we go down there, I 
feel I should give you one last warning. The rules as you know them, how the world works, those don't always apply in this temple. Hmm. Hey, what? Some people believe it's because this temple was made by the admin. The what? Supposedly he's some all-powerful ancient person. Built the world, I don't know. But the legend of the admin is just that. A legend. A story. Bunch of superstitious malarkey, frankly. I've been to the swamps of Funja and back, and that's still one of the more ridiculous things I've ever heard. Yeah, I've seen weirder than that. True. Old builders, wither storms, computers. Well, let's just agree to disagree. I'll give you one thing, though. Admin or not, what you're gonna see in this temple, it'll stay with you. Uh, we used this island as our staging area last time we were here. How can you be so sure it's the same one? Uh, perfect internal compass. The, the sea temple is directly below us. It's like I can feel it. Hey, uh, how exactly are we going to breathe? I knew a guy that taught me how to hold my breath for ten minutes. I mean, that's impressive, but... Picked up these enchanted helmets from the deep dwellers of Honbar Kavas. Time to suit up and roll out. Temples. That way. How... Compass. Right! Oh, that's so cool! Real question is, what are those plants? They're not in Minecraft. Are they something new? Are they going to be added? Who knows? Incredible. But I have never seen those plants before, so... Sure that we have all our limbs? How about we find that structure block? Hmm. Ah. Uh, I 
forgot they did that. Okay, that's not normal. Pretty uh, impressive, right, Petra? If you look closely, the carvings on this prismarine aren't like anywhere else in the world. Really? Yep, completely unique. No one's quite sure why, but you'll never have an experience. I, uh, I'm gonna need a sec, just to check my enchantments. Yeah, gotta make sure they're all there. Okay. Well, I'm gonna scout ahead. Huh? What's wrong? Yeah, uh, nothing, nothing. Must hit a patch of soul sand or something. Ooh, whoa, it's uh, got me, like, uh, frozen in place. I know it's pretty intense, but you don't have to be scared, Jack. But this is way harder than I thought it would be. Oh, boy. You're going to be okay. You're right. Thanks, Jesse. Guys, hey, I found something! Uh, be right there! Hey, uh, let's, uh, just keep this between you and me, huh, amigo? She's a fan. It's nice. Look, you have no idea how it feels to have everyone around you think you're some... has-been. I don't think Petra needs to hear about it. So... just hush on it. Ah, don't worry, Jack. We all get scared from time to time. Yeah, yeah, I, I guess. Hey. Thanks. I found the next door down there, but it needs that glove thingy of yours. What's keeping you guys? Nah, uh, nothing. Absolutely nothing. Let's check it out. Okay, that is cool. Sure. Let's see how cool you think it is when your life is on the line. Inches from the abyss. Ah. I know what I'm talking about, Nerm. Just do what I do, and you'll be fine, all right? Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, you're the boss. <laughs> he was like, yeah, you want to take over? I dare you, dude. Yeah. There are some more blocks I've never seen before. That red stuff kind of looks like some of the new terracotta, but terracotta doesn't glow, so. And there's the sea guardians, or whatever they're called. Guys? Move! Whoa, that was too close. Do you remember any of this, Jack? I... Huh. It's all a blur. It's a test, though. To see whether the adventurer is worthy of the structure block. Yeah. What are those things for? And it looks like it's made of glowing obsidian. Jack? Is that, uh, dark prismarine? Or something like it. Sponge is cool. It's like we saw at the entrance. Those are really good at soaking up water. All right, should be able to use those sponges to soak up the floating water the Guardians are in. Water floating in midair? That should be impossible. Well, if I know one thing, it's definitely not the admin. Oh, oh he won't listen to me anymore. Guys. Hmm. Are you being so fighty, Jack? Come on. Because I refuse to believe that there's some all-powerful dude running around, playing games with my life. Well, I don't know about an admin, but I really, really don't like that floating water. All right, enough with the admin junk. You said you saw sponges to soak up that stupid floating water, right? Yeah. Right, so we're going to use the sponges on the floating water, dry it up, and that should take out the Guardians. Dibs on that job. I think those stupid fish owe me. Okay, but uh, someone's gonna need to run the other way and distract the Guardians, right? Buy you guys time? 
Wouldn't mind having some backup, whoever's doing the running. Okay, I'll run and keep the Guardians off your back. You and Jack do the sponges. Yeah. Okay, everyone, let's get nuts. Ready. Ready. And go! Hey, laser lips! Oh, boy. Woo! What's it like being ugly and bad at your job? Sorry. Hmm. Oh. Jack? Hey, care to explain yourself, Jack? I don't have to explain my... Oh. You're right. I really messed up. I'm really sorry, everyone. That pile of inventory there? That was my friend, Sammy. Jack. No, I don't need your pity. I don't... I don't deserve it. I need to be alone right now. Whatever is left of Voss... must be somewhere down here, too. I don't know about you, but I want out of this room. Structure blocks gotta be close. How you doing over here? Okay. I can't stop thinking about what happened with Jack. Yeah? Just... If I saw your inventory piled down here, I don't think I'd be handling it much better than he is. Mine! All right, guys, I think we're going to end off the episode here. I think this is a good stopping point. So, guys, if you did enjoy, make sure you like and comment as a support to my channel. And I'll see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.